I love strolling on an empty street at five o'clock in the morning. I love discussing the absurdity of the world with wanderers. I enjoy watching the sunrise slowly waking up this sleeping world. I enjoy having random philosophical conversations with strangers. I make mistakes. I mess things up. I invite chaos to my life. And then self-sabotaged myself. I'm on a journey to accept my weakness, forgive others and myself at the same time. Sometimes I don't care what people say about my works. It's a record of how I see the world, but sometimes I long for someone to see through my art. I only want to mean something to this special person's heart. I laugh a lot. And prank even more. I cherish tiny happiness in the world. Like the hot air on a cup of coffee on a rainy day. Or see couples hug and kiss at the airport. I have a pessimistic mind, but an optimistic heart. I love and hate human beings at the same time. Their motives and behaviors confuse me a lot. They can't understand my intuition either. I'd rather stay away from the crowd. And keep people out. I moved from China to New Zealand in my twenties. Then left Auckland to London, now to Lisbon, at thirties. I've traveled four continents, but there is no place I could call home. I'm always being a Christmas and New Year orphan, but、I、never thought my loneliness is a misfortune. Through content creation, I found my roots and build relations. I'm still on the road. I don't know life's next episode. I just want to turn my existence into a poem. I want my life to become my exquisite art. Though the past is destined to be hard, with authenticity, I could find my truth.
。我喜欢在清晨五点漫步在空荡荡的街道上。我喜欢和流浪者们讨论这个荒谬的世界。我喜欢看着太阳从沉睡的世界中缓缓升起。我喜欢和陌生人们有一番哲思对话。我经常犯错，也喜欢把事情搞砸，但我正在努力学习。接受我的弱点。大多数的时候，我根本不在乎别人对我创作的评价。这是我的生活记录，是我对艺术的看法。但有些时候，我又渴望有一个人。可以透过文字看清本质。我只想对他一个人有意义。我底层悲观，但对未来又充满了希望，因为我还活着，活着就可以拥有一切。我爱笑，我爱闹。我真是微小的美好，像是阴雨天一杯咖啡上的热气，或是在街道转角看到情侣在拥抱我喜欢又讨厌人类，因为无法理解他们的动机和行为，他们也没法理解我，或者说，我宁愿拒人于千里之外。我二十岁的时候，从中国搬到新西兰；三十岁，又从奥克兰来到伦敦，再到里斯本，去过我想要的生活。我走遍了四大洲，但没有一处可以称之为家，但却在创作中建立了自己的根基。我遇到的每个人，对我来说都是世界。我还在路上。也不知道究竟要去何方。我想把生命活成艺术，把我的存在变成一首诗歌，尽管艰难，却因为真实而美丽。